All right, this is Medical Assisting 205 class, and today we're going to show you the proper way to do a diagnostic ECG electrode placement. Diagnostic ECG electrode placement, the quality of this is dependent upon the preparation and the resistance between the skin and the electrode. To ensure good quality ECG and minimize the skin electrode resistance, remember the following points. Ensure the patient is warm and relaxed. Shave the electrode area before cleaning. Thoroughly clean the area with alcohol and let dry prior to applying electrode. Prior to the ECG uh, procedure, the patient will be instructed to remove her clothing and place on a gown for the electrode placement. Hi, Ms. Matthews. My name is Marjorie and I'm an MA here at in Dr. Conway's office and she has ordered an EKG. Um, I've already explained to you that I needed you to get into a gown. So what's going to happen is I'm going to begin by placing some electrodes on you. So if I could get you to lay back, this will be completely painless. And I'm saying that she's training me on how to properly place the electrode for a EKG since this is the first time. Okay. Is it okay for me to be in the room now? Yes. All right. Thank you, ma'am. I'm just going to be over here cleaning the machine. Okay, I'm just going to need to pull your socks down a little because we have to put some electrodes on your ankles and on your wrists. Okay. So I'm going to pull these back. All right, I'm going to have to ask you to remove that. Okay. Um, oh, do you have the um, sensor pads? Yep. These are the electrode tabs, they're sticky and they will, the machine will stick to these and it will give the readings for the EKG. Okay. You always want to place the tab towards the machine so you get an accurate reading. You want to get on the inside to the meaty part. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Get both of your wrists. Again, it goes towards the inside, the meaty part of the wrist. This one's the left, and this is the right. Okay. I want to set up the right first. See the little prongs just stick right to the sticky tab. It's almost like jump starting a battery. Okay, I'm gonna let you do the rest. So here. It's gonna be right wrist and left wrist. So Here's this left. is the RA, this goes on the right wrist. And this goes on the left wrist. Alright, and then we gotta find our V1. Excuse me, I wasn't trying to okay. pop the field or anything. Okay, hold on a minute. Miss Matthews, now is when we're going to have to open the front of your gown a bit. Okay. We are going to have to place some on your rib cage and on the outside here. So I'm going to need you to open this for me. Is it okay, ma'am, if I, uh, you know, take a gander? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Get the lead straight. V1 needs to go on the fourth anacostal space at the right, vernal, uh, right border of the sternum. Well, if you want, I'll go ahead and get these untangled while you place the uh, place these stickers. Okay, and you do this by counting the spaces in between. So 
that would be one, two, and then for grading purposes, I just need three, to have a sheet of paper from each group with your name on it and what four. your task was. Yeah, sticky tab. Right there. Sorry, Miss Matthew, didn't mean to hit you. That's okay. Me on my grading sheet. Okay. 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 Ok
getting ready to start the machine. You won't feel a thing. I just need you to lie as still as possible. All right, so now it is performing the, um, getting basically a baseline on you, Miss Mara. And it's collecting the data. It's analyzing. You are very calm. You have a nice heart rate. 77. And then the machine is going to print us a report. <laughs> and it looks like everything's pretty good. No artifacts, no anomalous screening. But I'm going to let Mrs. Smith decide that. All right, well, we're going to let Dr. Conway decide that. So we don't need to do a retest or anything? No, I think this is good. Anyhow, Miss Matthews, we're gonna get you unhooked. Everything looks good here. And we're gonna give it to Dr. Conway and let you get dressed. And she'll be in shortly to go over your test results. Okay, thank you. So if you've done the EKG correctly, it should look like this with no artifacts. And um, no, interference. no interference as well. And uh, we also should have got a shot of us like, you know, doing love, <laughs> exciting and new. Come aboard, <laughs> we're expecting oh you.